Welcome to this guided witchcraft meditation for cleansing our spiritual and physical bodies and strengthening our psychic and magical power. In this meditation, we will work with clearing energetic attachments in your body that you may have to other people, places, situations or beliefs using witchcraft which is a powerful process that works with the subconscious mind to remove and clear away unwanted attachments and helping you to tap into your own magical power and energy. In the same way that there may be energetic attachments coming to you, you may also have attachments to others. In this meditation, we will gently remove all of these cords to you so that you do not attach yourself to other people or possessions. For everything that you need, you are able to find within yourself. As we move through this guide, there may well be feelings that come up that you will need to release. So be gentle and kind with yourself as this meditation unfolds these feelings will gradually dissipate, leaving you with peace and calm. Begin by finding a quiet and comfortable place where you won't be disturbed. Sit or lie down in a restful position and take a few deep breaths to relax your body and try and calm your mind. Take a little time to adjust your body into a relaxed and safe position. Close your eyes and begin breathing deeply and evenly. Feel your lungs rise and fall rhythmically with each breath of air that you take. As you breathe in, notice the passage of air through your nose, into the back of your throat and down into your chest. Feel the movement as it comes up from your chest and out back into the world. Soften the edges of your body and relax down into your chair or bed. As you inhale inwards, follow your breath inside of you to your inner world and there to stay Observe whatever is present for you in this moment. What feelings are you holding? What emotions are tying you here? What negativity can you see? Go deep inside yourself and begin to see those emotions that you don't want or need. Is it jealousy, anxiety, envy, rage, worry, doubt, despair? Once you have identified all those negative emotions, look at them from the outside. Imagine they are a separate entity to you. 
What colour are they? How big are they? What do they look like? What do they feel like? Not just as an emotion, but to touch. Would it be sharp? Would it be hard? Try and define these emotions as a separate entity to you. Looking closer towards this emotion, see that somehow it is attached to you by a cord, or maybe a rope, or maybe a heavy iron chain. How is it attached? What does it look like? How does this attachment feel? What is it made of? Is it rope? Is it metal? Or is it simply a form of energy? As you look at this rope that is attaching the negative emotion to yourself, you will understand what you need to use to break and cut this negativity away from you. As we start to use our imagination, you are holding a tool with which to cut this cord. Is it a large shining pair of golden scissors? Or maybe you are holding something more substantial, such as a heavy bolt cutter. Perhaps it is a carved steel dagger, sharp as ice. Feel this tool's weight in your hands. Tell me, what is it made of? Is it hard to hold onto? Feel it between your fingers and know its power. take a moment to visualise and go to your favourite place in this whole wide world. Is it by the sea with the running sound of the waves gently calming your soul? Or perhaps it is simply where you are enveloped in the warmth of someone's embrace? Maybe you are aloft atop a mountain, seeing the clouds beneath your feet. Or simply lying in your bed, as you have just woken from a night of restful sleep. In this, your favourite place, are you content? Are you calm? Do you feel free? What do you notice about you as you stand in your favourite place? Concentrate on the pleasure that you are getting from being here. Which part of it is the best? How does it make you feel happy or replete? Take a moment to notice all those tiny details in your environment. Allow it all to become real. Mm. 
once you feel that each moment of yourself is basking in this environment of joy that you have chosen for yourself, we can now turn our thoughts to letting go of those emotions. Pick up your tool. Know its power. You have already felt how clean a break it's going to make. And using it, cut that cord. Now, do you not feel lighter? Freer? Happier? And the relief that comes with letting go of leaving behind that which does not serve you. Gather in those feelings and take them into your soul, for you have rid yourself of this negative emotion. This cleansing of the soul has so many benefits for you in your coming days and years. It is your time to reap those benefits. So come back to your body, come back to yourself and breathe in and out and in and out. For we are now going to move on to increasing your witchcraft ways. I'll bring to mind a symbol or object that represents your connection to witchcraft. It could be a crystal, a tarot card, a wand or any other object that holds a special meaning for you. Visualise holding this object between your hands. You can feel its power beginning to grow. You can see its power beginning to glow as the light starts to emit from the object. With each breath in and out, it grows stronger and brighter. You can see it beginning to strengthen and increase, coming out of the object and into the air around you. It's bathing you in its light, which is calm and safe and beautiful. You can feel the light on your skin. You can feel the light on your face. It's safe, it's calm, it's powerful, it's healing. Enjoy this moment and connect to the light. As the light bathes your face with its strength and power, feel it coming into you, through your skin, healing you as it passes deep into your core, growing in strength and providing power for you. It begins to fill you up with its light. There is tingling on your arms, on your legs, on your neck. You can feel the power beginning to grow inside you. It is this power which you will use in your daily practice 
to enable you to overcome all obstacles you see before you. And it comes from within you. Where you feel that power settling into your body is where you will reach for it when needed. Here is the source of your strength. Find what part of the body it is pooling in the most. Is it your chest? Is it your tummy? Is it your throat? Or maybe your head? Because it is this area that you will reach into to use this power when you most need it. This is the area you will come to in order to draw forth the energy from within, to place it into your craft as part of your spells and rituals. It is also the place that you will use for when you're speaking with the world of spirit. For it is this power here which will enable that communication. So learn this area well. Feel the power pooling there, waiting for you to take it. Knowing that you have the power within you. This makes you happy and calm, strong and brilliant. Let those feelings flood through your body, filling up your toes to your tips of your hair. This is the power of witchcraft. And as you feel the happiness flooding through you, slowly come back into the room and feel the air on your face and the cushions at your back. And when you're ready, and take your time, slowly blink open your eyes and come back to the present that you are in. Be kind to yourself today. Be kind to others today. And thank you for listening and practising Increasing your psychic strength with me, Ginny Metherill. Come and join me at Ginny Metherill for more witchcraft tips and how to practice so that your soul remains as light as it feels now.